I'm Troy Richards. I am Knut Hubinet. And we're artists collaborating on a project called The Seeing Glass that opens November 13th, 2017 here at the Delaware Art Museum. Mm -hmm. The Seeing Glass is a virtual reality uh, simulation, mm -hmm. immersive experience that will place a viewer into a 19th century Victorian uh, boudoir room <laughs> based on Rossetti's painting as, that you can see behind us, La Bella Mano. There's this idea mm -hmm. towards um, verisimilitude, towards, mm -hmm. towards getting towards like the, creating a very realistic environment. And we are instead focusing on, on creating a, uh, I'm playing with the idea that it doesn't have to be realistic. It can actually, yeah. we can make this world. So mm -hmm. um, we're using a game engine, which is a game, game design software mm -hmm. to develop the world um, and give it and build a play with it, sort of create our own rules mm -hmm. for this environment. To emphasize the dreamlike aspect of mm -hmm. it, we are going to do things such as have uh, give, we have different, different, different still lives, yeah. like fruit and flowers mm -hmm. and different things like this that are alive, mm -hmm. and they'll be aging at different speeds. You know, different speeds, like uh, over five to seven minutes a day or longer, and a virtual reality will be on, on through the whole day doing that. Um, as you walk through the space, um, some things will be out of focus, in focus as you move, the speed, how you're moving, doing that. Um, you probably can also interact with some items. We'd say the entire experience will typically last between three and seven minutes depending on, on how, how long the person wants to stay in the mm -hmm. space. And it will continue. It doesn't, the, the, it's, as it's a, a simulation and mm -hmm. a virtual game, a virtual world that we're creating, the, the world just continues. It doesn't, it doesn't have a, it's not as if it's a video where there's a clear beginning and end or, yeah. or there's a story arc to it. Mm -hmm. uh, it really is just more of this immersive experience. Yeah, yeah exactly.